Hey guys, welcome back to Big Pools Down Under and we're back at it again on the grind for the bounty, on the grind for all things that Team Coach have to offer. And we're here with another box break, doing this yet again on my birthday, trying to extract as much birthday love as I can. First box, wasn't bad. So, oh, we really, really want to, I don't care if it's, it's just got to be any one of the bounties. Need to be in one of these two boxes that I've got left. So, let's get into it eh, and find out. All right, here we go. Now, can we find our first case card at the very least? If we can't find a bounty, can I find my first case hit of the season for Team Coach? All right, first pack, what do we got? We've got a gold card. We've got Nick Blakey in the gold and our pop-up scan lens is Charlie Kerno. Yes, I think, what was it? The gold, the gold tribute is like one in half. There's like two per case, basically. So, although it's good, it's not a case card. All right, it's stuck. Why are they always stuck? Oh, we've got a, oh, we've got a tribute. Jeez, these are common, aren't they? All right, we've got a magic wildcard tribute for the giants this time. Wow, straight off the bats. What's that, second pack in? Third pack in, maybe? Unbelievable. And our pop-up is Aaron Norton. I do like these, so what year is that from? 2014, Lockie Whitfield. 2015, Toby Green. 2017, Josh Kelly. And 2019, Stephen Canilio. So there we go. They've stuck it out since the inception of the Giants, haven't they? And they're sitting on top and looking pretty. All right, so we got a, a tribute to start off with. I still don't have a feeling for how I feel like the boxes work. So if you like get a tribute, does that cancel anything else out? Still not sure about all that yet. All right, gold, Tom DeConing. And our pop-up is Darcy Parrish. It is usually the way you do start to see a pattern. You know, like for a lot of boxes last year, I felt if you hit your box hits really early in the box, you were gonna find something good later. We got a gold here. We do. All right, Caleb Sarong. Gold, Bess and Ferris. Very nice. We're getting a few of these now. Seem to be quite common, really. Just like the uh, tributes. I think I found one in every opening so far. And Charlie Cameron, including a gold. So we've still got tons to go. We've literally just started. All right. First card craft, we've got Archie Perkins. And Scanlons is Mitch Lewis. Come on, footy gods, what are you doing to me? Come on. Give me a whopping great Scott Pendlebury Majestic Collage card for my birthday, please. All right, Mitch. M Michito Switchito. Oh my lord, team coach. Not even Connor Rose in Scanlons. I don't know. <laughs> well, I guess the name of the card is Odd. Bod. But maybe they need to be odd names or something. All right. Oscar Allen in the card craft. And the big Texan in the Scanlons. Yeah, my uh, fantasy team is uh, not good. Not good at all. And I keep forgetting to do my team coach game, so I haven't done any of those this season yet. Majestic Luke Parker. And Luke Davies a Yunyaki in the pop-up. So I gotta pull my finger out. Otherwise I'm not gonna get any prize cards. I think I only got like one or two last year. Although I was just as bad at remembering to do it last year as I am so far this year. Dusty Martin in the Majestic and Stephen Canelio in the pop-up. But we'll soon work all that out. If only I could work out a consistent way to open these packs. I'm so used to having to struggle. All right, Silver, Bess and Ferris, Noah Anderson, and Nick Dacos in the pop-up scanlons. And believe me, I'm trying. I've got a few videos I haven't uploaded yet. Actually, I've got a few that I have to record yet. So 
so who knows it might be different all right silver best and fairest a jacob weedering and mitch owens in the scales but this has got sort of like one of those regular normal box feels doesn't it seems to be the norm to get like a gold and uh tribute so far i've noticed it's very very common anyway ollie wines in the majestic card craft and james sicily scanlins are you guys noticing that too tributes are fairly common i know not everybody's opening boxes all right josh dacos silver best and ferris but you're probably starting to notice the theme of how irregular some cards are. Lucky Neil in the Scanlands. All right, come on. It's time. It's time for a gold collage. Scott Pendlebury, Majestic. Well, we got gold, but <laughs> it's not the right one. Harrison Petty in the gold and Sammy Draper in the Scanlands. All right, well, we're over halfway. We still haven't had our team star power or our true wildcard box hit. All right, odd bods. Took the Tenacious and Tom Hawkins in the Scanlers. Come on, come on. I thought I was in for some all sorts of luck when I had all three at the same time and then it was my birthday the next day and I thought right this is all lining up perfectly I'll open them on my birthday this has got to be a good omen it's not working out yet Josh Dunkley in the gold and Jai Simpkin in the Scanlands yeah I had a feeling like it was all the stars aligned for me I was like oh here we go the bounty's finally gonna start we're gonna hit one gonna get our first case hit but no not yet Tom Stewart silver best and Ferris, and Jordan Dawson in the Scanlands. But, what's the old saying you say? It only takes one pack to change everything. It's all it takes, one packet. With one big card. We've got big Joe Danaher in the card craft and Tom Libertore in the Scanlands. But, we are getting low and we're still two box hits short. So, they want to come out soon. I don't like it when they go to the end. All right, here's our team start power by the looks of it. It's another black variant, is it? It's Adelaide Crows. Sort of a darkish blue, actually, really. Very nice, Rory Laird. Team star power. I do, I, it really is growing on me, especially these ones for the dark. I really like the dark. The neons are gonna look crazy. And Toby Green in the pop-up scanlands. But that looks really good. I don't know how well it's coming up on the camera for you guys, but that looks really good. I mean, you guys would see that anyway when you get your own cards, how good they look in hand compared to what you see on a camera. All right, what do we got this time? Oh, we've got a Star Wild, very next pack. It's for the Bombers. Oh, look at that. Mason Redman, look at the... <laughs> I like it. That's a really cool picture. The Bont one was really good too. That's cool. That's what you come to expect from, you know, the wildcard art, the pictures. Not just a normal looking character, but you want something like that. That looks cool. I like that. And our pop-up is Tom Papley. Papley to pop-up. Very nice. Tell me, what do you guys think of this year's wildcard set? I reckon they look really nice. I know there's not a lot they can do with the wildcards, but I don't care if they look very similar. It comes down to that, the animated artwork for me, for every card. That's the change you want to see. Something cool on that. Big Peter Wright in the gold, and we've got Brad Crouch in the Scanlands. All right, we're nearly out of packs. We've got all our guaranteed box hits. Is there something else for us in here? Oh. Another fantasy. I haven't seen a fantasy duo yet, but I've seen a few of these ones. I think this is my third one of the, the fantasy card. So we've got Jordan Dawson. They're a nice looking card. I don't mind them. Not my favorite, but they're a nice looking card. All the same. Got a bit of a uh, pop in them. 
very nice okay so that's probably our extra extra box hit so can't really expect much more i don't think oscar allen in the scanlons yeah so yeah i think that we can at least say we know now that it looks like the regular thing or you're a high chance of having you know five or more box hits is what it looks like to me a silver star power zach merritt and harris andrews because yeah it definitely feels like that like i've had a gold best and fairest and a magic tribute card everything i've opened so far odd bod all right darcy the dasher a little bit more of a regular type name nickname and we've got dan houston in the scanlons all right well this is it lucky last pack Still no pack love from the footy gods. They're not feeling it for me yet. Well, I've got one more box to open on my birthday. So we'll see if that changes everything. Hey, we say it takes one pack. Maybe it just takes one box. All right, silver best and fairest. Nothing massive in here. Christian Petrarca and Jacob Weedering in the pop-up scanlons. All right, guys. Well, that's box number two for my birthday opening done and dusted. Still no bounty. I'm sorry, guys. I am trying. I really am. But I've got another box to open today. Don't know when it'll come up sometime next week. So hopefully in there we can find a bounty. But for now, I'll do some sorting and uh, we'll have a recap. All right, here we go. So still no case hit for 2024, but we're still getting plenty of good hits. So we've got our odd bods here to start with. We won't put them in the same as really good hit basket. They're just three inserts. Then we've got the card craft, Archie Perkins. Oscar Allen, we've got a Luke Parker Majestic, a Dustin Martin Majestic. Ollie Wines in the Majestic. And we've got Joe Danaher in the regular card craft. In our silver best and fairest, we've got Noah Anderson, Jacob Wiedering, Josh Dacos, Tom Stewart, Christian Petrarca. Geez, you get a few of those in a box, don't you? In our gold commons cards, we've got Nick Blakey, Tom DeConing, Harrison Petty, uh, Josh Dunkley, big two meter Peter Wright. In our gold best and fairest, we've got Caleb Sarong. In our team star powers, we've got Rory Laird. That looks really nice. Black's still my favorite, but that dark blue looks really nice in the light. Very nice. And how's that for a picture? That looks really cool. I love that picture. So I hope to see more of that kind of funny art design on the wild cards. So that's what it should be like. So we've got Mason Redmond in a star wild. We also got a fantasy, Jordan Dawson. And we also got another Magic Wildcard Tribute card, this time for the GWS Giants. I'm fast collecting these. They're very nice. Well, there we go, guys. Sorry, no bounty collected again, but we will keep on grinding. If you enjoyed that video, please consider hitting that like button for me. It really means a lot. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. Head on over to my page. Have a look around. Plenty of stuff there. Check out the uh what was it 20 case hits we got last season in my highlights video and as always guys i appreciate your time thanks for watching and i'll catch you on the next one cheers